Welcome back, Dr. Nobles here with evidence-based exercises for common complaints. Today we're going to look at four exercises for scapular dyskinesia. Uh, this is another one of those shoulder exercises that there's a lot on the internet showing you all sorts of different exercises. So again, I've tried to recommend some exercises uh, that have evidence behind them but also are a little less mainstream than what you might be currently finding. The first exercise is called the TYI scapular depression. Lay on a bed or a table face down, then bring the arm up to the side in a T position. Lower the arm down and then bringing the arm up to the diagonal, lower the arm down and then bring the arm straight overhead in an I position lowering the arm down. The next exercise for scapular dyskinesia is called the trapezius stretch. Reach the arm back behind you, take hold of the opposite elbow. Once here, bring the ear towards the shoulder of the elbow that you're holding onto until you feel a stretch through the side of the neck. This is the upper trapezius muscle. The next exercise is the low row. Bend the knees, hinge at the hips, Get some small weights and then bend the elbows in close to the sides. Straighten the arms and then bend the elbows again, doing rows with the small weights. The next exercise is called Brueger with band. Get a band or a strap or a rope and then bring it out to the sides, getting some tension through it and then bring the arms slightly back behind you so you're stretching the arms back. Then tuck the chin in towards the chest, lift the chest, and work on your posture. These four exercises can be used for scapular dyskinesia. If you're doing the exercises, start with three sets of five, working up to 10 reps over time. If the exercises are gonna work, you'll know that they're working within the first week or so. If the exercises are not helping or seem like they're making things worse, and stop the exercises and find another way to heal yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that this helps you heal your shoulder pain.